Hi everyone, it's me again, Disabled Fly Baby, back with the Bible Life. Okay, today I want to talk about some of the Bible Life books. I listened to Joyce today and she kind of reinforced the idea of the to keep the book idea because um, that's the way she studies. She turns around and she listens to a chapter and then she goes back and she puts down everything she learned in that chapter into a book. Okay, so I definitely want to get back into the books. I kind of thought they went out of season. Everything goes into seasons in our lives. We go into these different seasons. So, yeah, I kind of thought that was going out of season, but it's very wise to keep that idea. All right. Um, I did bring the books to go to my sister, go to my sister up in New York, but she stayed in the hospital the whole time, so I never did get them to her. And I really, I'm going to have to take another trip to New York eventually but I plan on doing a lot more journeys and a lot more going here and there so it's in the it's in the works eventually not anytime soon got a few things to do here in Virginia all right so anyway let's get back to it so if you read the chapter and you go back in the chapter and you write down everything that you learned you might need a little of like a loose leaf some loose leaf paper some pencils and some um, highlighters. It depends on what you like. If you don't like color, if you don't want to highlight the things that you really learned, don't worry about the color. But if you want, if you like the color and you want to enhance it so you know you're learning more and more and you feel good about it, go for it. Just however you like to do it. But the more you learn, there's power in the wisdom of God. All right, there's real, real power in the wisdom of God. I totally suggest everybody to read the Bible and listen to it on disc and I'm not a strong reader so I never was very good at reading the Bible but I started listening to it when I got separated the second time I got married twice I got separated from my second husband and I listened to it on tape it used to be on tapes and um it shocked me so much of it in the, that's in there. You will not believe what you will see in that Bible or hear in that Bible, but you'll know. So if you're driving down a road and you've never listened to it before, I don't think I would, I, I, don't, I wouldn't suggest it. Cause unless you know you've lived, lived a, a golden life <laughs> and you are sin free, free, that would be okay. But um, yeah, just be careful. But yes, I highly suggest everybody listen to the Bible or read the Bible. Combination of both. Study and learn. It's great. All right, so I guess I've rambled on enough. All right, God bless you. Let's say a little prayer. Lord, our Heavenly Father, please help this to help others to reach out and touch your word and to love you and to love your son. In Jesus Christ's name I pray, amen. Bye for now. God bless.